There are a lot of new golf courses in Florida. Let's see two of the finest. One is in Sarasota. And now we're looking at a Tiger Woods Pop Stroke Golf that just opened up in Sarasota, Florida, outside UTC. Let's see how it stacks up against Goofy Golf. What's really interesting is to see how much Tiger Woods Pop Stroke Golf has in common with Goofy Golf. You see, both of them feature two different 18 hole putt putt type golf experiences. Pop Stroke's family friendly, and so is Goofy Golf. The difference between the two is that Tiger Woods is a little bit more of a skill based, and the other one is a little bit more entertainment and amusement based putt putt experience. And here is Goofy Golf. Let's explore. Let's check out Goofy Golf and see how it compares to Tiger's place. Now, could this be the best golf? course in all of Florida. This is a little bit dated, a little bit retro, needs some paint, needs some updating, but it's a lot of fun. Compared to Tiger Woods, of course, Goofy Golf opened in 1959. It's located on the Miracle Strip right on Panama City Beach. There are two 18-hole golf courses with unusual structures like Sphinx, monkeys, dinosaurs, and weird goofy attractions. No, I know what we need to do. What? Let's have to we'll, we'll get some video of like the, those people playing the holes. Ostrich is moving. This place is a little dated. It's old school, but it reminds me of a kinder, gentler America around 1960. Turns out the founder, Lee Copeland, created Goofy Golf. Lee was a retired iron worker who used his imagination and artistic skills to create many of these concrete, plastic, and metal sculptures here at Goofy Golf. How are the holes numbered? A tarantula spider. Oh, it goes up and down. Yeah. What a scary spider in this hole in one. Two foot. We gotta look at some of the other ones on. I don't. They're all I think we had to walk on the other side of that. So some of them are skill and some of them are moving. Oh, an outhouse. Oh, look at the little potty. So you have to probably shoot up for it to come down through that hole there. Uh. Now let's see what's happening at Tiger Woods Pop Stroke Golf. Hey, this place has really good food, lots of big screen TVs, chances to play golf, even a playground for the kids. And look at the outdoor dining at Pop Stroke. Eat, putt, and drink. Okay, this is the bar. It almost looks like you really are in an official clubhouse. Look at all those putters. They have colored ones for the kids. Okay, the pricing is about anywhere from about $15 to $25, depending on your age group, to play golf here seven days a week. They have an all-day pass for 25 bucks, too. Daddy, Daddy. This is the clubhouse. Now, I wonder how the clubhouse at Goofy Golf compares to this. I didn't see too much beer at Goofy Golf. Well, this bar is really happening. Generous portion for food. Very impressive. Equal mix of kids, a lot of big screen TVs, outdoor games. Whoa, this is a long way from Goofy Golf. 
it's sometimes uh, like a fake AstroTurf type of carpeting. Looks like they don't have to mow it, but it looks immaculately green. This is the view from the first floor balcony. As we overlook the fairways here, and you see there's not any concrete. You continue to walk on the AstroTurf between holes. You see sand traps, a lot of lush vegetation, tropical lighting, rock music. It's a total experience where you can bring food, play golf, and hang out. Cheese! Hey, thank you. There's several bars here. Let's look at the food. They have a crispy chicken sandwich for about 13 bucks. Black and mahi, a smash burger, 11. They also have jerk chicken tacos. Somehow I think there's better food and drinks at Tiger Woods than at the Goofy Golf. This is the view from the first floor balcony. As we overlook the fairways, there's not any concrete. You continue to walk on the AstroTurf between holes. You see sand traps, a lot of lush vegetation, tropical lighting, rock music. It's a total experience where you can bring food, play golf, and hang out. I love the contours of the fairway here for the putting. It mimics a real experience, and there's even a fun children's playhouse here. Now we're on the top floor here of Tiger Woods Pop Stroke Golf. And now we're gonna see if we can get a decent view. Okay, we're a long way from Goofy Golf. Look what's happening here at Tiger Woods Pop Stroke Golf Course. Newly opened in Sarasota. Dozens of people, probably a few hundred actually I'd imagine. Lots of opportunities to drink, play golf, and go putting. It's gonna cost you anywhere from about 16 to about 25 bucks. They have an all day $25 pass. But you can tell this at this minute, this is red hot. Progressive presents today's to-do list for your cat. This place, I can like, see the correct sidewalk and like the painting and everything. It is so hilarious. Hey, Goofy Golf is a good value. It was created in 1959 by Lee Copeland. It's still run by family members. I believe his daughter, Michelle, still is pretty act. Hey, Goofy Golf is an incredible bargain. For 12 bucks, you get to play 18 holes. There are two different courses. Some include glowing eyes, giant crazy monkeys, and even dinosaurs. What are you looking at? This is kind of creepy. Is this a hole? I don't want to hit my head. Look at all these stalactites. It's like Luray Falls. Oh my God, look at this. What hole is this? Oh my God, I've never seen such an incredible hole. Oh my God, don't scare me, man. Here, where to go? Okay, so let's give our report cards. This place wasn't created by an accident. It's not a whimsy. There are no dinosaurs. Now I sure hope Goofy Golf survives. Both are fun, both are interesting. So let's let's rate. I don't know, what do you think is better? Goofy Golf or Tiger Woods Pop Stroke? Okay, so let's go in terms of imagination. Look at the contours, interesting course, limited spacing. If success is, you got tons of people willing to pay 25 bucks. So the free enterprise system gives creativity, imagination to top stroke. Okay, in terms of food, dinner, drinks, I think there's a better supply of drinks and food here at Pop Stroke. In terms of nostalgia, sentimental value, I'm gonna give it to Goofy Golf. Hey Goofy, I hope you survive. You are a historic place, a treasured attraction. 
it should be a designated U.S. historical place. So now you can see our reviews of Tiger Woods, Pop Store Golf, and Goofy Golf. Some people may like Goofy better, others may choose Tiger Woods Pop Stroke. Both different. Remember, in Panama City, enjoy Goofy Golf. Hey, need a favor? If you enjoyed this video, hit like, subscribe, and comment.